Grill, swim, and moisturize. We're talking about the summer health habits you should continue doing throughout the year. And this one just may surprise you. You wouldn't dare hit the beach without SPF on your skin. But did you know the sun's powerful UV rays can also sunburn your eyes if they're not properly protected? And damage like that could leave you seeing double. So we're wearing these glasses as a prop. Your eyes are actually very sensitive to UV radiation. Something I actually see in the emergency department often, something called UV keratitis or UV radiation injury to the eyes. It can actually cause burning, stinging, gritty feeling in your eyes. This happens often when people are outdoors and there's a reflective surface, whether it be snow or a lake. So you need to be aware of UV radiation for that acute injury. But another thing can happen, if you're constantly exposed to UV radiation and to the sun. Uh, we call it surfer's eye, but there's something called a trigium. And what happens in a trigium, and the wide of the eye, usually the part that's closest to your nose, actually has excess buildup of tissue in what's called the sclera here. And it's almost a scarring. And you can see it there because usually it just grows over the wide of the eye, again, the sclera. And it's more of an annoyance. But repeated UV exposure in the sunlight increases your risk for it. Things like windy conditions can, but occasionally, like you're seeing there, it will actually grow over into the cornea, can get into your visual field. That's when it becomes something beyond just a nuisance. And for really bad ones, a surgical you need surgery, repair is right. the only. I think nowadays they, they scrape it off using a laser. But you know, it's not just the eye itself, Dr. Travis, but it's the eyelids. It's that framework around the eye. So sensitive. Why is that? The skin of your eyelids, upper and lower eyelids, is the thinnest skin of the body, the thinnest dermis, no subcutaneous fat. So very, very sensitive to UV rays. So it's so important to make sure that you apply sunscreen, wear those sunglasses. Sunglasses are going to protect your eyelids from that direct sun. And sunglasses look pretty cool, right? Yeah. You, you all like these? You like Well, to protect your eyes, we're going to send everyone in the audience home with their very own Colby Polar sunglasses. But this is the take home. When you're buying sunglasses, make sure they protect against UV radiation. Otherwise, you're doing yourself more harm than good because you're blocking some of the light, but your eyes are, are wide open and you're still getting that UV radiation. So please look and make sure that your sunglasses protect against UV rays. UVA and UVB. Absolutely. So broad spectrum. Oh.